All right. Uh, read for us, Katham. Now. All right, so let's look at this worked out example. I'm going to show you guys how to simplify the square root of negative 75. Class, what are the factors? What are the numbers that multiply to be negative 75? Anybody? 25 times 3. But 3 times 25 gives me a positive 75. So this would have to be a negative 1. Here's the lesson from yesterday. Partner A, tell partner B, what's the square root of negative 1? Aristotle, what is the square root of negative 1? It is I. <laughs> Class, what is the square root of 25? The square root of 25 is 5. And there are no two number identical numbers that multiply to be 3, so we'll just leave that. How would I write my answer? I would write my answer like this, 5i radical 3. Now, you might say, Mr. Ng, your answer does not look like what they have over here. And I will tell you why I prefer mine over theirs. A lot of students will extend the radical sign and it looks like the i is inside the radical, which would be incorrect. So to make sure you don't put the i inside, I put it on the outside or in front, so I see everything in front is on the outside of the radical and everything inside the radical is more on the right side. Thank you, Mr. Frank. That's encouraging. No, that makes me... F I, I appreciate that.